The Page Proofer app for Adobe Business Catalyst makes it easy for your team and clients to leave feedback on sites that you're developing and sites that you've already developed. To set up the app, all you need to do is simply copy this one line of code into the head of your templates. For this site, we keep the head of our templates inside of an include file called head.inc. This is where I'll be placing that one line of code. Next, you'll need to log into Page Proofer. You can do this by going to the Page Proofer website and hitting login. Once you're there, click on the site that you're managing and you'll find the account ID in the URL and the site ID. You will put that into the app as follows. And now you can hit save. Now if you're logged in um, in the back end and you view the website you'll now see the page proofer code start working and you can start making your changes. To add a comment to a page you can just double click and you can leave a note you can choose who you're assigning it to, choose the priority, and choose the status of this, and hit save. Now when you go back into Page Proofer, and you'll refresh, you'll see you now have a nice list of your to-dos and all your comments, and what are in progress and which are complete. If you're on a development site that has .businesscatalyst.com, the app will automatically detect that and display the page proofer, but if you're someone who has a partner portal with a custom BC domain, such as this website that we're working on here, champinternet.com is the custom BC domain, we can also optionally fill this field in. We can hit save, and now if we open up a new private browsing window that would have no cookies, you can go to the website, and you'll see now that you're still seeing the page proofer app and it's prompting me to log in because obviously it's a new session. So another thing you can do if you don't like that, if you don't want that to pop up for anyone, you can click on disable page proofer on business catalyst domain and then when we go back to that window and refresh, you'll see that it's not working. But if we go back and enable it, we can see now that it has come back. By disabling this enabled checkbox, you will disable the functionality of the app. Now that you've seen how easy it is to install and use Page Proofer on your Business Catalyst site, download today and sign up for your free trial at Page Proofer.